What's up guys, this is Dead Rockstar here, and for the past two weeks, Mod Informer has been in a Borderlands-induced coma, and we're ready to come back stronger than ever. <laughs> nah, not really, but that would be cool though, right? I have been playing a lot of Borderlands though, and as of now, the game has no major mods, but we've already seen a few skin replacements for Maya, so who knows what a couple months might bring us. Without further ado, Let's get on with this. So originally, I was going to showcase a handful of different weeks, but for the sake of time today, I'm only going to be covering two different ones. So the first thing I want to show off is a fast approximate anti-aliasing injector, or a FXAA injector for short. These are nothing new to PC games, and I came across this one in a certain YouTube video. After doing further research, this was originally for Test Drive Unlimited 2, but it seems to complement Borderlands just fine. You can see it gives a sort of purple and blue tint to the game, but if you give your eyes some time to adjust, it looks pretty nice actually, and it brings out the colors really well. It takes a sort of flat haze off the top of Borderlands, and it just seems more clear. Personally, I love this. I've grown accustomed to it, and I prefer playing it. The effects are adjustable, so maybe you want to tone down the saturation, or even add a sort of sepa tone to the game, you can do all that from within the adjustment application. It's a pretty surprising find, and I wouldn't be surprised if it works with other games as well. Another thing I want to show you is the SMAA injector. SMAA stands for Subpixel Morphological Anti-Aliasing and was created by the Eurographics stream and Andre Dudenhefner. This works just like the FXAA injector, but this is specifically to fix aliasing. In layman's terms, it straightens all those dreaded jaggies. And it does a hell of a job. This is a little bit harder to see to an untrained eye, but right here I have it singled out pretty good. It will help a lot if you view in full screen, but if you focus on the lines, you'll notice they'll become slightly finer, and it just does a much better job than FXAA does, and it just makes this tweak well worth it. So that's all I have to show you for now. If you know any other mods or any other useful tweaks out there for Borderlands, make sure to let me know. This has been Dead Rockstar from Modern Former. Don't forget to subscribe, visit the website, and stay classy.